days, and you got a lot of stuff going on. We're about 10 minutes away from the unveiling of Taylor Tyler to, is it Mariah? Maya. Maya. I think it's Mitzi. Mitzi. Uh, it's kind of it's kind of weird because I'm I'm not used to talking to him and seeing him that way, uh, but we got that coming up. But right now we need to talk to Logan Donahue, who oh, has the field guide to the gay day. What, hey. What's up? Hey, how are you doing? You, so you have this guide. You're gonna help us understand some slang and Logan uh, stuff like that. You yeah. can maneuver around the gay day. You know exactly. What I mean? Yeah, my my show that I just did, our Orlando friends just called the field guide to the gays. Okay. And so I I hope to teach some knowledge to you guys. Okay. Um, Tell us, tell us about your show. Field Guide to the Gays is a one-man multimedia safari into the gay community. Okay. Where I let people know all about the floor and fauna you might see if you see a real-life gay in person. <laughs> or, or what sort of slang and lingo you might hear them say. Like, um, you know how, you know how, like, if you have friends or family of any minority and they might talk in their jargon, Absolutely. like, what? what? What's a bear? Yes, what, what, absolutely. What exactly is twerking? Yes. What is uh, reading? What are these things? Yes. So, yeah. We don't know. We, we have a whole different definition for twerking. Yes. I know. <laughs> they have it all wrong. Let me just preface what? that. I, I, I believe that there can be a world with two definitions. I'm okay with okay. that. Yeah. So, well, amongst the gay community, I guess, with twerking, first off, yeah, it is the booty dance. Yeah. yeah. The booty dance, that's, that's, the isolated that's, that's cause that's we, yeah. this, Gays have a secret love for anything of the African American community. <laughs> we appropriate it and bring it into our into our own world. Amen. Okay. <laughs> but on top of that, twerk is the alternate way of saying work. So if you think really? someone is doing something well and you go, what? which is what you would say if you think someone's doing something well. Right. Uh -huh. You would also, you could also now alternately say twerk because twerking is so popular. They've turned that into okay. the alternate uh, version. The work of 2013. So say, hey, yeah. man, what are you going, what are you going to say? Twerk! <laughs> <laughs> That's like what I say. No. Like when I'm going to work in the morning, I say I'm going to twerk. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> work, would, work is an interjection for when someone's doing something with professionalism or uh, effortless expertise so and you want them to do it do. more. If you see thought, but if you saw someone like dance and you'd go by Go work. Yeah, exactly. You'd be like, twerk. Yeah. Or if someone oh. is, or if someone is uh, doing a really wonderful dissertation at their college, and you think that it's wonderful, you'd be like, twerk. Okay, okay. They, okay. Well, they sounded intelligent. Okay. So right now, if somebody just walks by and just say, twerk, then they'll be we're doing all right. That means they like the show. Yeah. But yeah. You really like, hey. if, someone, if someone walked by yeah. and said, twerk, they probably live for what they're right. doing on the radio. Here's your challenge. Use that word somewhere this weekend. Exactly. <laughs> well, there's, there's other words. Like, uh, have you heard of reading before? Reading? Reading. No. Okay. Reading is a thing in the gay community. We love ver verbal sparring. You know, like, like kitty has claws. Kitty so has like, claws. Yeah, exactly. So you get to, like, verbal spar with each other. Reading is like when you roast someone on the spot. You'll often hear gay men or drag queens especially read each other. Okay. Yeah. Like, if someone walks into the room, it's not it's not the same thing as being mean to somebody. Okay. Like, if someone walks into the room and you... And they're wearing like an unflattering gray dress, and you say like, "Oh, I can't believe you left the house." No, that's not a read. Okay. A read would be like they walk up to you, you give them a hug, and be like, "Girl, I didn't know you're half manatee." <laughs> that would be a read. Okay. It's, oh. it's basically roasting somebody, but instead of like <laughs> okay. selling tickets, it's whoever's listening. Okay. <laughs> to do this, you got to be somewhat friends. Oh yeah, yeah. Well, you can read someone if you're enemies, but it's going to be fighting words. Yeah, it's going to start the whole now, thing. Now, if you did that to somebody and I'm walking by and I thought it was good, I could say twerk. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly, you, you caught on quick. <laughs> you just clutched my whole course. That, that is, is too funny. Wow. Good. See, I can assimilate myself to anything. Uh, you don't have to come to the show now. Give me, give me, give me some more. Give me some more words. Oh gosh, reading twerk uh, shade. Okay. Yeah. Taylor Tyler told, told him to uh, throw a shade. Oh, what is throwing shade? shade? Well, it's it's like the word like when people say something's like a shady dealing or whatever. It's like mm -hmm. that word, but shade can be a noun. Like if someone's throwing shade, they're being passively aggressively evil to you, uh, saying something kind of weird. Like, oh gosh, example of shade. Like if someone if someone's being shady and you noticed it, you could probably say like, girl, did I leave my sunglasses on? Cause it's shady up in here. <laughs> Meaning that you notice that someone is being untoward towards the other gay. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> you can affirm someone's shadiness by saying twerk. Okay. See, it all comes full circle. All T, all shade. All T, all shade. <laughs> all T, all, all shade. Oh, the T. The T. The T. Okay, the T is gay slang for the truth. Okay. So if you think someone is 
about to tell you the truth or you want to know what the newest gossip is, you would be like, girl, what's the tea? Give me the tea. Yeah, exactly. Oh. It's, 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 it's like, like the Shakespearean yeah. times yeah. you would say, what news have you? Yeah. But yeah. no, where yeah. is the gay community? Okay, so like, girl, we, what's the tea? So when we do trash shit coming up, I'm going to say, what's the tea? You're going to say, what's the tea? She's uh, serving up tea realness. Now, uh -huh. if Johnny, oh, if Johnny oh, were to say it. something that I thought was uh, the tea, I could the say, tea. ain't that the tea? <laughs> what? <laughs> You'd be like, that's the tea. Uh, okay. Yes, that's exactly. I'm getting this. <laughs> yes, you are. <laughs> Congratulations. So what other, other, other stuff you do in your routine? Because it sounds like it's, it's extremely funny. Um, it's a, It's basically myself and slideshows and video clips and little musical interludes. I basically try to show people almost like Jane Goodall documentary style, <laughs> like a guide to the gay community and the history um, and that culture. There's some stuff in it that is like serious, but most of it is, you know, we're just going to go out here and say anything. There's nothing off limits. Yeah, the when are you going to perform it again? Um, it's going to start back up here. Wanzi Presents has picked it up to do okay. a double bill here at the oh. Parliament House. It starts on June fifteenth, so in two weeks from now. Awesome. So that's Saturday, June fifteenth. Um, and the tickets go on sale on onesiepresents dot com real soon. Like, uh, if not right now. I'm gonna go check this <laughs> oh, out. Yeah, when, when, sure. when is uh, do you have a, a website, Facebook? Um, you can basically Instagram? follow us on Facebook. Um, Field Guide to the Gays. Okay. Uh, if you look it up on Facebook, we're there. Um. Or, yeah, onesandpresents.com is where to go get your tickets. But, yeah, we, we love friends on Facebook. Actually, there was a thing we did where people could ask questions, any question they wanted, and we might put it in the show. And we're going to open that back up for this this installment. So if people have a question or even, like, something they heard someone say uh -huh. about the gay community, they could, they could pose that question, and it might make it into the routine that night. Well, thank you for coming out. Welcome to Sprinkles. Thank you. Thank You're you awesome. for coming out and, and, and talking to me. We are now educated. You are. <laughs> that's the tea. You can move yeah, that freely. That is the tea. Yeah. Work. <laughs> <laughs> All right. When we get back, two things are going to happen. We're going to talk to uh, Taylor Tyler and talk to yeah. him.